close all the lanes. Now all the lanes of all the highways leading out going inland are all going to be one way. Government officials have a nightmare on their hands because of the slow movement. The right. fact that this is not, you know, a lot of the, a lot of times these troughs pick up the storms right. and they, and they move very quickly to the north and east. This one is not moving. One mile not an moving. hour. So Unbelievable. All right. All right. Meanwhile, uh, Janet, Thank stay you, right Janice. there. But six minutes after the hour, Griff Jenkins, as we told you earlier, at Palm Beach, uh, an evacuation underway, right, uh, Griff? That's right. Good morning, Brian, Ainsley, and Steve. And we are uh, on Palm Beach right here at Worth Avenue, Mar a Lagos, a mile and a half to my south. And you know, some of the most expensive real estate is to my north. But as Steve was pointing out, 120 miles due east of me is a Cat 5 monster. And when people wake up here, we've been down here looking at the water because here on groins and jetties, you have some of the strongest rips. The rip current, the storm surge already coming here. We're feeling just a little bit of the outer bands, but we wanted to quickly show you. Look up here to the seawall. And Steve, you're well familiar with this, having been here a lot. It's only about 50 to 75 yards to get there. And this isn't a typically normal surge. This is going to grow. And as Janice was talking about, whether it is a tropical storm or gets even closer, it is a hurricane. The beach erosion is going to be a massive impact, let alone from the storm surge, six to 10 feet. It's going 